being here. Welcome everybody to Harvest. And uh, thanks to the group from Better Ballots who's uh, helping to invigorate the debate about the nature of politics during an election campaign. It's great, and especially the focus on trying to find new models of reforms that might take effect in the election of 2014. I think this is a great discussion because it's part of the necessity of a broader conversation about how we make the nature of civic government more transparent and easier to navigate for people. From a budget process that needs to be demystified, from more community involvement in parks and such, I think this is all part of the values of, that are designed to try and encourage greater participation. Uh, as a provincial member of parliament, I supported the work of the Citizens Assembly on reform and supported the initiative that they advanced and the riding of Toronto Centre in 2007, I believe, had the second highest level of support for that initiative. So I'm firmly on the record as one that does believe in the necessity of finding ways to continue to reform the way that we uh, go about uh, democracy. I think that we should form a committee of council on democratic reform, and that would be an issue I, I would undertake as a mayor. Thank you. Well, I too want to say uh, thank you, uh, not just to the Better Ballots uh, group, but also to all of you who have expressed through uh, all of the uh, heat in this uh, room your uh, good temperament and especially your great interest in the civic affairs of our city. I take a lot of uh, comfort in knowing that so many people are so concerned about the future of the city. As a diverse city where we say diversity our strength, we have an obligation to act out our strength and to make sure that diversity isn't just a logo or a brand or a slogan. And I think some of the proposals that have been advanced here this evening are very important in that regard. I support allowing permanent residents to be able to vote. I was a supporter of the initiative in the 2007 elec election for democratic reform at the provincial level, but supporting these reforms is not enough. We need a cultural change in the way that our civic enterprise is governed in the city of Toronto. We have to let the communities back in. We need to revolutionize, we need to modernize, we need to open up the doors of City Hall and demystify the nature of the processes that are there now. It's uh, going to be a long election campaign with a wide variety of debates. I rather suspect that very few of them will live up to the quality of this discussion tonight. And that, I think, is a real uh, comment, at least a compliment for me, uh, to the quality of the work that was done in organizing tonight's debate. I thank you again for uh, giving me the chance to participate. And as a gay man who is part of the diversity of the City of Toronto, I hope that I can encourage your support on October the 25th. Thank you.